So, the Wheel of Samsara, I think that's how you pronounce it, Samsara or Samsara or Samsara or whatever it is, the Wheel of Karma, of uh, death and rebirth, basically, I am kind of questioning, does multiversal karma carry into each incarnation? Because if that's the case, given that karma is as above, so below, the pendulum swing to the right, to the right is equal to the pendulum swing to the left, doesn't that mean that since there are infinite universes and infinite versions of reality where your karma went in both directions already, does that mean that access to the multiverse is escaping the wheel of samsara, or does each universe have its own, have its own karma? Because I, I don't doubt that there are universes with different laws of physics. Uh, I've never been to them, obviously. Well, maybe I have. Maybe I just didn't know that the laws of physics were different. But there are definitely universes where um, karma doesn't exist, obviously, because the universal laws, metaphysical laws, physical laws, and sub-physical laws are different. So I guess, uh, I guess karma probably stays within its universe. It doesn't, uh, go to a different universe with you, unless karma is attached to the ego, which is, like, probably why Buddha said you have to, um, get rid of the ego, basically, is what he said, I think. But that's not possible at least with our modern definition of the ego. So maybe he meant that you have to uh, develop a healthier ego. Um, so I'm not really sure if karma carries into the multiverse. I mean, it's not like I'm going to take that chance or whatever, but now I'm really seriously curious, and I have no idea how I would carry out an experiment to find out. So, uh, yeah, this is, like, just going to be a two-minute video. Hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like, subscribe, comment, and share if you liked it. Goodbye.